Alright, today here is the Google Pixel 3 XL 15 July, yes And I just received an update notifications for Android 12 Beta 3 I'm so excited to show you what's new and what are new features But before that, let me get it updated to the latest versions Update available. Let me turn up the brightness so you can see it clearly. System update. Let's get this. Okay, as usual, this update will install a beta versions of Android 12 SPB 3.210618.013. So I hope this update will be smooth, stable, stability will be great as this phone is my PV driver. And let's stop talking and download and install. And before this, I will do a screenshot. Yep. All right, resume. So with the Android 12 Beta 3, um, there will be some new features or maybe I would say updated features. Like um, there will be custom material U accent color in the Android 12, but choices are limited. Yes, sadly. And second thing, there will be like redesign wallpaper picker And you can even share your links directly from the recent menu And also, with the Google camera uh, There will be added uh, material UI accents And also there will be also on the Pixel launcher too Whereas for the setting menus, there will be some changes like um, Instead of going to the colorful icons It will go to the just plain black and white icons and there will be a new prompt um, to let you know about uh, how to use the widgets. Yes, and also yes, the most long-awaited features, um, the scrolling screenshots. There will be more features added in this beta 3, but I will show you in the next video. Meanwhile, this is the Android 12 beta 3 uh, update progress. I'll show you how it's like to update um, software update on the Pixel. So far with the Android 12 Beta 2, uh, I would say it's nothing short of amazing. Uh, everything is smooth and fast and stability wise is so much better than Beta 1 which Beta 1 was kind of like disappointing cause it was like sudden reboots or maybe add sudden close or even uh, the brightness will auto adjust itself out of nowhere. Whereas for Beta 2, I see that there are still some bugs but I can cover one eyes and say it's okay because the functionality wise are all working well um, whereas for battery life uh, so far uh, it's good but I would say as this phone is nearly like 3 years old um, battery has deteriorated for maybe quite some I could say it's worse so um, I might be replacing this battery and I will do a battery comparison um, after I replace the battery so you can look, keep a look out of my new video coming out after Android 12 final version is out and I will make a video uh, showing you the battery life of Android 12 on the Pixel 3 XL so meanwhile let's continue and watch this video and hope you like this video yep. give me a thumbs up We're almost done downloading this is right here We're almost done and yeah, let's wait and I just really hope that this beta tree will be stable for daily usage optimizing apps hmm, I can see that it's much faster than the previous Android 12 beta 2 update because the previous update was taking way too long and so far this video is around 6 minutes I could see it's so much faster than the previous update 
I see some good things about this. Okay, so far this is how the videos I've made. Like the first update, beta 1, comparison, beta 2 and beta 2 yes. Really happy to see the viewers ships are get going up. Thank you so much. Um, it helps a lot and I really really appreciate all uh, the viewers. Thank you so much and also thank you for all the comments I've been receiving uh, throughout all the 4 videos I've been doing for Android 12 on Pixel 3 XL. Um, I really 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 appreciate uh, these comments and viewers. Thank you very much. Meanwhile, let's get back to the video. And if you guys is like thinking how much I like about this phone, I would say it's a near perfect phone, especially about the camera. Because I've been using many phones like Samsung Galaxy Note 9, Note 10 Plus, Isus Zenfone 6, uh, the what, Poco F2 Pro, uh, and even more other some other phones. I would say I would still go back to Pixel phones in terms of the camera quality. Okay, as this phone has been it's like using three to four years old sensor, it still does a better job than the newest phones, when which is really amazing, especially especially on the camera department, which is very useful in terms of the quality, the output, and also it comes with Google Photos with all the functionality without having to subscribe to Google One. Google Pixel phone is the phone to go. Yeah. If you think that stock and joy is the things you want and also you like the camera to be tip top condition and you want to be the best everything or what right go for pixel and and you know in the future there will be a google pixel 6 pro or maybe i don't know a 6 6 xl i will look forward to getting that phone pixel 6 xl yes um, i look forward to maybe i don't know according to leaks maybe it's like five years of software update and also an even better improved camera I think it's time for Google Pixel 3 XL to have an update to in terms of the camera hardware and has been using the same sensor for I don't know how many years already yeah it's it's time for them to change yeah I hope Google Pixel phone the next one the next flagship not the mid range I'm talking about the flagship uh, Pixel phone I hope it will be better camera hardware upgraded uh, the battery uh, capacity I hope it's uh, bigger of course because currently my even my, my current and secondary um, back, uh, main phone it's the, the Asus Zenfone 6 it's already using a 5000 mAh um, battery so I really hope that the Pixel 6 or whatever Pixel 6 series will have better upgrade cameras upgrade batteries processors oh yeah even the next phone is the next google pixel 6x or whatever is using google in-house uh, chip so i hope that the next phone will be the best all-in-one uh, phone yeah i guess for pixel phone i would say from the first series with the first one to the fourth yeah the battery is kind of small I hope Google will be more generous in giving a larger battery so that our phone will last even longer. Well, I hope Google listen to this. I think it makes a big difference with big battery. Take more photos, videos. You really need a high capacity battery. Yeah. Google, please listen to us. Thank you very much.
is taking quite a while to load to optimize the apps. Yeah. Good things comes when people wait. So I will wait a while more for it to optimize. Okay, it looks like it's done. I mean, the one restart first. Okay, I mean, screenshot. Okay, so here's update we install speed up versions. Okay, no talking, and let's restart this. Finger across, hope this will be good. Android 12, beta 3. Okay, system update installing. I should take a screenshot instead. Yes. Okay, hope you'll be great. Okay, as usual, done installing update and this pop-up will show you that this device is enrolled in the Android beta program. So, Android developer and enthusiast to try out pre-release versions of Android. So, to learn more about blah 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 blah, auto up just visit this website. But never mind, it's okay. So, right here with me, I finally update to Android 12 beta 3. Okay, let me unlock my phone. Okay, so here we go. So far, it looks okay. Okay, let me do a screenshot about this. As you can see over here, it's the S logo, Android S. It's supposed to be a dessert name, but it w it was removed since couples of Android versions. So right here, I have finished the update, and this is the icon. Oh, button to the edge to hide it temporarily. This is an I would say toggle to tone down the brightness during the dark time like at night when I'm using a using phone well using phone at night is not a good thing but well this, this feature will be really really great and so yep this is Android 12 beta 3 and so far I can see it's a sneak peek of the Android 12 beta 3 oh well so they removed the colorful icons and SPP 3.210618.013 So this is the Android 12 beta 3 Finally and it's Android 12 And I've been thinking why it's not 12 yet So because it's beta So with this Android 12 beta 3 So they finally put the digit 1 2 Okay, I've been waiting for this so long So whether I see any changes Well, I guess they're the same Hopefully the final versions they will show Okay, yeah, it's still showing 11 so meanwhile, hope you liked this video. I'll be doing another video with all the new features of Android 12 Beta 3, all the features walkthrough in the next video, yes. So uh, I hope you liked this video and if you look forward to more Android 12 features on this Google Pixel 3 XL, 
or even about the Android 12. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up, like a button, and also subscribe to my channel so I can keep you more update on the new videos. I will walk through all the things you want to see. So if you find that anything is missing in this video, just leave me a comment below and I will try to reply you or I will even make a video with what you want to watch in the next one. Remember to press the icon the beside the subscribe, subscribe button so that you'll be notified for new videos. Okay? So see you, see you in my next video and thank you for watching. I appreciate all the viewers and the comments and thank you.